Hello and welcome to our first use of the overhead setup, which you can see right here. Hopefully this will help me make more art videos in the future, but today we're going to use it to unbox this beautiful zine pack created by Shin Chang. It's called the Seed Bag for Resourcefulness from Hamburg. And the cover is basically this cool package filled with all kinds of stuff. It is called a seed bag for resourcefulness. Look at how gorgeous this is. I don't even know how they made this. This is a really pretty paper with pink, bright pink on it. So there's like a bunch of zines in here, not just a single thing. We're just going to go over it very quickly. What does this one say? What is a designer today? Okay. This is very cool. Making by... And there's a little hole. I can't imagine how much this costs to print. Open this. And it's a zine inside. Beautiful. And there's an interview. About everyday resourcefulness. I believe uh, Shin Chang runs a blog related to that kind of thing. I think the blog is also called Everyday Resourcefulness. Wow, that's my house. It actually is my house. That's me, actually. <laughs> that's when we were building our house. Hey. So, this one I already read. I'm not gonna... <laughs> this one is so beautiful. How do you like these colors? Green with pink and the back. What a cool effect. This one also has little holes in it. Wow, look at that. So beautiful. And then there's sideways text. A view of the Kefir lump retrieved from Berlin 2019. I think I'll have to read the text to find out what that's all about. What is this? the starch number three. All right. With them, whilst the text is being read by the audience, thus who is being associated with I, we, and they is oscillating through changing the readers and in the differing imaginations of every audience member. Wow. Look at this. So it says who the publisher is. Published by... HFBK Material Verlag, supported by Creative New Zealand. Gorgeous! I love these colors. I can't even begin to imagine how much these color this costs to print. What is a designer today? This is very complicated. I started to read this. I am not. I don't. I think this is stuff relating to the design world that is maybe specific to them. At least I don't understand it. I don't know enough about design to understand what was going on in this. I tried to skim this, but I did not understand a lot of the words. This one, I already, I actually, I know this is, I'm calling this an unboxing, but I actually played with this a little bit last night. This one is called Rubber Trails. And it's all about tire reuse, which I love. This is great. This is tying together bamboo with pieces of tire. I mean, it makes sense why this stuff is in here because I, I believe, if, you know, if this person is in the design world, then they're looking at objects. And this is all about sort of creative reuse of objects. This is about sandals made from tires, which is really interesting i support that that's why it's called the rubber trail but then it's so because so elastic dialogues this is a different thing look at how gorgeous this is i know i keep saying that but it really is so beautiful the amount of work that went into this i can tell it was a lot i really appreciate it someone appreciates all your work here's all these little holes and it's so it's like two books see so this side is like one book 
This side is another book, but you can't separate them. They are bound together. And I discovered something else. There's a secret pocket. You can pull stuff. And there's even a drawing inside the secret pocket. So beautiful. So I pulled this out. There's a whole other thing in here. There's poetry. There's some art. This is the coolest parts that I've found so far. Look at this. Oh, that's backwards. Look at how gorgeous this is. Yes. Who, 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 who did this? How do you do this? How do you... Who, who has typeset? And how did they get that cool burned effect? So... I love it. I'm going to put this back. I'm not going to put this back right now because I want to hurry up and get to the rest of it. The biggest part of the package is this thing with this cute rubber band on it. This is called Humane Edges. This is literally 70 pages. Nice. That's how you do a shelf. I like it. There's this hanging plastic bottles. Yes, we've done this. We have hanging plastic bottles. Phnom Penh, Cambodia. Nice. That's like a street side water dispenser and there's even little towels and a cup dispenser. Adorable. This looks like it's in, oh yeah, it's like in a yard next to a playground. So cute. Stuff for hanging stuff. Hanging stuff is very important. I am constantly hanging things. So I understand the highlight of hanging things. <laughs> oh nice this is all different things to do with coat hangers wire coat hangers i love how they highlighted the coat hangers in a different color so you can really see what's going on if some of this is meant to you know if this is meant to be like in the aid of design then this is really what helps someone like me because i can't really some of these are a little bit tricky to see otherwise now this is the good stuff hanging stuff using macrame basically it's you make a little net to hold something so a rock is ground anchor for a sun umbrella so this is when you have to weigh something down love it wow look at this cool spider chair that's cool nice hong kong scaffolding with bamboo. I love how irregular it is. This is tying together pieces of bamboo. Very useful. It's good to know how to tie, how to join things without uh, nails and screwdrivers and whatnot. Ooh, garden stuff using plastic. Good. I think this is so far my favorite because it's not as like it actually shows stuff a lot of the more theoretical stuff was kind of hard for me to follow because i'm not a designer but this stuff i can see kind of like you know how other people mo modify the spaces around them that's really what it's about in the u.s we're kind of you know there's a lot of limitations on modifying public space and even private space. Like if you rent, you know, you can't modify the inside of your place. This is so cool. This, this tree house. Gorgeous. So you can see, I think they got some funding. It looks like from Arts Council New Zealand, HFBK Hamburg, Creative New Zealand. So, well, anyway, this has gone on for 10 minutes. 
Hope you've enjoyed this unboxing of the seed packet for resourcefulness by Shen Chang. And thank you for joining me on this journey. See you next time. Bye.